I'm reading what's on the face of this sexy front bucket loader. <laughs> Damn, girl, you got some fine treads. You can dump on me anytime. You can use that bucket on me anytime. You can fill up my holes. Oh, yes, and we've got to do with these this uh, guy killing oh, ants over here. It. No, there's probably another viper gunslinger over here now. And here is one of the vipers. Oh, <laughs> and she's dead. There is Big Dave's brother, Big Dave. Hello, Big Dave. Oh, I'm missing your foot, huh? And your arm. <sighs> Tough day, huh? <laughs> yeah, I know how it goes. Hey, look, we're back at the 188. Welcome back to the 188. And buy some shotgun rounds. I don't need shotgun rounds. Welcome to the 188 Slop and Shop. How can I help you? Change the name, it's gross. <laughs> whoa, 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 what is this? We have a friend here. Malcolm Holmes 2.0! What? <laughs> what? Got him! What the hell? What? No. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. <laughs> no, 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 no. Did you do this? What, what makes you think I did this? Did you do this? What the hell? You cannot have Malcolm Holmes 2.0. <laughs> He's mad we took his... He was so couch. mad he came back from the dead. <laughs> no. He ain't coming back again. I said he ain't coming back again. Oh good, he destroyed his head so that way he'll never come at us again. No, he can never come after us again now. He will. <laughs> I'm, I'm sure that was the last we'll ever hear of Malcolm I'm, Holmes. I'm sure it was. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> You're shaking your head like you don't believe it. We'll buy some 12 gauge rounds. I didn't mean to open my pit boy in front of you. I'm sorry. I, I hate to show you things that you can't have. <laughs> Are we? Even, am I even going the right direction? Uh, no. I don't think so. Who the hell are we? I have actually. I forgot. I I, for, I was just. We following played. You. Oh, we're at the Aerotech Complex. We probably went in the exact wrong direction. We probably did. I've. I. You know. We say we played this game to death, and we know it front to back. But oh my god! Like I go in the <laughs> wrong direction all the time. Where the fuck are we? Excuse me, good sir. Do you know where we might find Boulder City? Oh, I'm sorry. You're a cactus. Uh. Yeah. So. I don't think it's going to respond. Cactuses are notoriously very slow thinkers, but they give they give very accurate information. Cacti. Boulder City, please. I guess you were done talking to corpses, and now you have to talk to plants now. Oh. I see stuff over there. See, I told you the cactus would tell us the right way to go. Ah! Free money! Free money? Give me money! It's not an ATM, it's a crazed robo-brain. My pin number is 1234! <laughs> Come on! I need 50 bucks! Could you please take care of it and help us out with this bigger one? I'd appreciate it. What bigger one? Account number 3783! Pin number is 1234? Oh good, he's giving me money. Ow! I need real money! Ah! <laughs> Today is the day of weird glitches. <laughs> Every day is that day in Fallout. Oh, good lord. I think we're heading to Camp Golf, which is... Yeah, that is Camp Golf. We're pretty far away from where we need to be. We're lost. Why are we lost, Zach? I don't know. We're lost because I'm following you, and I don't know why we're following you. Why are we Fo not following me? Uh... 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 Go. Yeah, but it's okay because we're lost together. Yes, and isn't the journey more important than destination? Yeah, man, life is a journey, not a destination. Yeah, when it's with you, it's a very prolonged journey. I like this tree. This is a nice looking tree. It's telling us to go this way. You get all your directions from plants. Oh, have you ever done the alternate speech thing with this guy? Uh, alternate speech thing? Do tell. So, if you want to piss him off really bad, you like shoot at the monument. What the fuck are you doing? My brother died at the Battle of Hoover Dam. You're desecrating a war memorial. You're a little bitch and your brother was too. Oh no, it's not. <laughs> <laughs> Let's not do that. 
It's just kind of funny to be a complete asshole sometimes. But yeah, we're not actually going to do that because that's, that's so mean. I don't even have anything to say to him anyway. I didn't realize they had the names of all the people on the back of it. Uh-huh. And there's PFC Donald Kowalski. I think that's the guy's brother's name, right? Oh, probably. I don't even see it. Where is Donald Kowalski? Halfway down, right in the center. Oh, Below wow. Whitney Maxwell. I don't know how you saw it that quickly. Yeah, right there. D- PFC Donald Kowalski. Yeah, that, that guy's name is Kowalski, right? The yeah, so that's his brother. He seems like a strange character. New in town, huh? Your timing couldn't be better. What do you mean? Well, Buckaroo, I was just on my way out of town. And here you are to take my place. Ah, just a coincidence. And a boring one at that. But that's why it's so impressive. You don't see the gears moving, taking us round and round. Circle of life is what it is. That's why whenever I kill a man, I don't feel right until I knock up a girl. You know, <laughs> just to help keep the rat moving. I... Okay. The name's Vincent. Vincent Vincent. Second verse, same as the first. Seems a little redundant. Not just a little. Extremely redundant. Which makes it unique. <laughs> Alright then, man. Where are you going? East, maybe. Or west. Shit. Wherever they got kill us, cunts and caps, that's where I'll be. You should follow us instead. We need really? another follower because we lost Malcolm. We had to put him down. Uh, <laughs> sure. Oh, no, no. No, bad idea. One goes in, one goes out. Two can't go in. That fucks up the mass something serious. <laughs> On the other hand, nine months ago, I knocked up the speed-up old Raider in exchange for some jet. I bet you both my fuzzy die. She's having twins. <laughs> All right, you convince me. The math works out. <laughs> Just say the word, and I'll carry the one. <laughs> okay. Shit, I gotta piss so bad my eyeballs are treading water. <laughs> What the hell is with this guy? I don't know if we need this many people, though. <laughs> well, we're not going to dismiss Hope. We can't send her on her way until we've found the plant for her. Oh, God, that plant. I completely forgot about it. <laughs> we never actually talked to her about why she needed that plant. Maybe we should do that right now. Uh. <laughs> you hear what the chatty cat said to the tongue? I just don't get you. I don't get it. Shaddy Cat said to the tongue? Because it's like, Cat got your tongue? Nah. If that's... you can't if you can't say anything, it's Cat got your tongue. Right. So it's, whatever. I'm not, <laughs> I'm done explaining this pun. It's really bad. <laughs> that is probably one of the worst puns I think I've ever heard. <laughs> anyway, tell me about this dumbass plant you're looking for. Well, I guess I can trust you. It's not the plant so much as what's in them. Doc says they feed on rads like bees to honey. You get sick and a plant like that'll flush it right out of your system. And that's what I need it for. A friend of mine, his wife, she's dying. Why not use Radaway? They tried that already. Even got her in one of those suits in case the air was bad. Doc said the plant's the only thing that'll save her. It's hard to take her seriously. She's still wearing that party hat. Okay, then. Thanks for helping. I ain't good at this sort of thing, but... I just want to say I owe you one. We've been dragging you around the wasteland for the last... Eight weeks. Eight weeks. So, yes, we're not exactly helping you expedite this process. Right, yeah, we're kind of... We've got a situation with some great cons right now. Don't interrupt. One of my patrols was on its way back from Novak when it came under fire from the great cons. They radioed for reinforcements, but instead of waiting for us, they chased the cons into the ruins where they were caught in a crossfire. No deaths, but not all the squad got out. The cons have Private Ackerman and Private Gilbert as hostages. I might be able to negotiate a deal with the great cons. Normally I'd turn you down since I have no idea who you are. But considering that the hostages are as good as dead when we attack... All right. All right, so how you want to do this? Because if you do want to do a firefight, we can clear these guys out. No problemo. Nah, I'm going to try and talk to them. What's to negotiate? The NCR backs off. We walk out of here. Nobody gets hurt. I'm going to use my ungodly charisma points. I can't believe I'm doing this. But all right, the hostages can go. The NCR had better keep their end of the deal, though. I'm glad you are able to get my people freed, but there's a new problem. I just got orders to take out the Great Cons, hostages or not. 
Great cons let the hostages go in exchange for their own freedom. My hands are tied. I can't go against orders. Can I? The great cons were nice. You have to be nice, too. <laughs> Why is that one of my options? You're right. The great cons are free to go. <laughs> Let's talk to Vincent Vincent a little more, because I think we don't need uh, another companion right this moment, but maybe he's got something interesting to say. Why do I hear gunfire? Uh, what's going on now? We Probably more raiders or jackals or whatever. Probably another wily ostrich. What the? Ah, shit, here we go. Somebody killed Victor! Yeah, someone killed Victor. Who, who is this guy? Get him, ho! Knock him out! Oh, it's a disguised viper. Oh, it's a viper disguised as a member of the NCR. We can take this guy out. So this guy just killed Victor. What a prick. Jerk. Well, I don't think he'll be getting back up after that. Is Victor coming back? Well, that kind of sucks. Rest in peace, Victor. Oh, killing time! <laughs> I'm not big on conspiracies. The people in charge got nothing to hide. After all, if they make the rules, it's legal for them to fuck you. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> That's a very good point. I like this guy. I like the cut of his jib. Uh, do you seriously have children? That's what I said. One for each man I've killed. Spread out from coast to coast like an army of ugly little bloat flies. <laughs> Do you visit them occasionally? Are you fucking kidding? What kind of father would I be if I let someone like me hang out around my kids? <laughs> oh my god. I'm sure you're not so bad. What makes you think you'd be a bad parent? Well, I'll tell you a story. I once owned a pet cockroach. Figured if it could survive a nuclear holocaust, it could survive my parenting. <laughs> I put it in a glass jar, and sure enough, it died a few days later. Someone told me it's because I didn't give it any air holes, but I remember sticking a needle in its back. <laughs> what the hell is wrong with this guy? Growing up with no father is much more traumatizing. I would assume. I would assume, I don't know. But they have a father. Me. <laughs> Oddly enough, that makes perfect sense. Sure it does. Much sense as a gills on a dolphin. I'll try to think about that. Just let that one soak in. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? I love this guy. Uh, what sort of skills do you have? I try to familiarize myself with all weapons. Out here, you gotta be good at everything. Most times, the only weapon you got is the one the dead guys drop. What about you? How do you kill folks? Blade, bomb, and bullet. How do I kill people? Let me count the ways. I like shotguns, but shotguns isn't on here. So you prefer short-range weapons? No, well, I guess mostly pistols, then. You're a cowboy, then. Big iron on your hip. I can respect that. Pistols can pretty much do it all. They're light, got range, and they're easy to smuggle. And when you're out of bullets, they make for an excellent boomerang. At least in theory. <laughs> <laughs> they make a terrible boomerang. <laughs> This guy is a loony. <laughs> Are we going to keep him with us for a little while? Uh, sure, yeah. The South American vulture. A small bird capable of carrying up to six times its body weight. A bird that is known for its beautiful mating calls, which it does seven times every mating season, every day. What does the vulture's mating call sound like? Squirrel, 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 doodle, 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 I can't believe they're not extinct yet. The Vipers have returned. Why are you disguising yourself as NCR soldiers if you're just going to jump out of the shadows and ambush us? Yeah, they did not think that plan through. I'm sorry, I'm distracted by this plant. Oh, 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 you want to be like that, huh? <laughs> it wants to be your friend. Hope is doing a bit of damage with that Mutant plasma beast weapon. Is dead. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! Watch this. I'm gonna nail these guys in one shot. Oh, come on. I was so close. But not that shot, apparently. <laughs> out of memory. The moment I pull the trigger and it's on target, out of memory. Of course. Uh... 
I've heard drinking your own piss is totally fine. Piss is sterile. But if you bottle it and say leave it out in the sun for a few days, I'll let you say I've had better ideas.